Hey everyone, Genevers here. Welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be talking about how Hypixel has successfully implemented 1.13 uh, compatibility into the 1.8 slash 1.9 slash 1.10 etc etc server which they have at the moment or they had at the moment so they made this tweet earlier today and i thought i'd cover this just because uh you know it's very interesting because they kind of went into some detail about how they actually managed this uh with all of the data changes and stuff and uh, so they made this tweet and it says we have released support for the latest Minecraft version 1.13. Our team has worked hard to make sure that the server support at 1.13 on day one. You can help out by reporting any bugs you encounter. And uh, also, Spigot has updated. Oops, not that's the Twitter. Uh, via version, I, I don't know why I was on Spigot's Twitter, but via version, which is basically the plugin. Hypixel doesn't actually use this. Uh, the Hive does, I think, but they uh, they updated to 1.13. They said 1.13 is one of the most complicated updates we've had, considering the support of the project and helping us continue. Yep. Um, and here's the thread. So Hypixel now supports Minecraft version 1.13. Now I'm covering this because I made a, a previous video where I was talking about some of the challenges that they might face if they try to implement the 1.13 engine into uh or it can you know have it make it uh compatible with the 1.8 version right and you have all the block ids change uh the me metadata or something like that change so like for example uh th there's a bunch of blocks that now have the same or very similar data uh but they they can actually get around this by basically rendering the world a third time now they actually have to render it a second time for the 1.9 update and i didn't actually know that but we're going to uh, read this thread right now. So, uh, developer note. Due to the changes with the Minecraft chunk rendering between 1.8 and 1.9 to support version crossplay, we have to render the game world two times. Although you would never notice the impact, it does require extra processing power for the servers. 1.13 brings further changes, which means we are required to render the world for a third time. So, that's pretty much how they've gotten around uh, the update. Now, I guess people like 2Pi and a few other were correct in asserting uh, that you know they would be able to support 1.13 with little to no cost in terms of player performance, um, which I'm surprised by because some other people that I've been that I was talking to previously were telling me that the 1.13 update would be relatively difficult for them to implement without causing major uh, player performance issues. For example, like a lot of lag spikes and stuff. But uh, at the moment, we feel confident we can support all versions after 1.8 with no impact to you, the players. However, we are considering dropping support for 1.9 to 1.12 at a later date to make sure we offer the best possible experience for 1.8, 1.13, and future versions of Minecraft. So what do you guys think about that? Do you guys think that they should drop 1.9 to 1.12? It is like only like 5% of the servers playing on those versions, right? Because I think it's like something around like 50% is on 1.8, then like 40% is on... Uh, or forty five percent or something is on the latest version, and then everything in between is like between you know five and ten percent. And another good and just have one point eight in the latest version, they might only have to re render the world uh, you know twice, not three times. So it would reduce a lot of strain on the server. But uh, it's worth noting that Hypixel is still optimized for Minecraft version one point eight point nine. We aim to support all future versions by mirroring the gameplay of this version, but for the best player experience, we recommend using one point eight point nine. Blah 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 blah. Anyway, it's not an easy task to make sure we can support the latest Minecraft version, so special thank you to Plong, Zero Arrows, and Lakaios for making it happen so, happen so quickly. And yeah, so that's pretty much that. So that's the end of that story. We are extremely lucky that it was not as bad as people, you know, some people were making it out to be. And uh, to be honest, uh, this is all very good news. It's, it's good that they were actually able to update it. Anyway, um, I'll see you later. Peace out.